When I first went to the DMV to get my driver's license, they asked if I wanted to become an organ donor. I never thought about it, so I looked at my mother for guidance, but she said it was up to me. So I checked no to become an organ donor. Not because I had something against it, simply because I didn't have enough information to be comfortable checking yes. Like, do doctors let you die in your deathbed if you're a registered donor? Pero si no he fallecido, ¿cuándo deciden usar mis órganos? Those were some of the concerns I had when I decided to check no. But after being educated by the Got the Dot program, I got to see a different perspective about how I can benefit people's lives. I learned how I can benefit people's lives through my organs. I can save up to eight lives and help 75 others through my tissues. Not only that, you can also sign up as young as 13 years old of age at the Donate Life California Registry at the DMV. Knowing now that I could give multiple people a second chance at life, I would have definitely changed my decision and gotten the dot earlier. Let's talk to some others to see if they got the dot. Hello, today we are with? Lori McKellar. And the first question is, are you an or organ donor? And if so, why? Um, I actually am an organ donor. And about 27 years ago, I had a premature baby and she needed actually an organ donation. And I thought, wow, that's really a great thing. It was super important. So I thought, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be an organ donor. Right. Hello, today I'm here with? Amy. Uh, our, first, our first question is, are you an organ donor? And if so, why? I am, because I believe that it benefits a lot of people if they're able to preserve your organs and let them continue living when you can't no longer live. For a third question is, um, do you know anyone who has received an organ transplant that you would feel comfortable sharing with us? Well, my daughter, she was um, born three months premature and unfortunately she didn't make it in time to get her transplant. Other than that, I do not know anybody else. I'm really sorry to hear that. Thank you. For our last question, do you know how or where to become an organ donor? No, not specifically. You can become one by checking yes at the DMV when applying for or renewing your driver's license. You also can by searching up donatelifecalifornia.org. And pressing the pink sign up button. Next, type in your information to become a donor. Or if you don't want to become a donor but still want a way to support, you go to www.jjslegacy.org to make a charitable contribution to a good cause.